Alright, welcome back to the Talos Principle. Remember that conversation we had last time about, like, the future of the series and kind of my plans moving forward and all of that? You don't? Because I deleted it all? Is that what happened? Yeah, it turns out that took way too long for kind of nothing, so let's try again. Too long didn't read version. I just wanted to mention my, like, plans, because we're coming up on the end of the, the main playthrough. Right now, I'm leaning towards, as soon as we're done here, in the tower, and the star level, and the uh, messenger area, and all of that in the base game. We have a lot of stuff left to do. Like, we have achievements, I think I have like half of the achievements, and I've not taken a look at any of them, we'll do that later. We have like, all the stuff playing around with Milton, and getting hints for the red levels, and doing like, out of bounds, and no clipping stuff, and all of that. But most of that is probably not super interesting to people. So I think as soon as we're done here, I'm probably just gonna jump straight into Road to Gehenna and then play that, hopefully all the way through. And then once we're done with that, we'll jump back in here into the main game and do all the like bonus stuff and then maybe do bonus stuff in Road to Gehenna. So just so you know, that's kind of where I'm leaning right now. I don't know if that's the best way to do it or if People think like, oh no, you should check out easter eggs first in the main game and like, whatever. Or, uh, oh, you should do the uh, the main game's achievements first and then Road to Gehenna or anything. But I don't think anyone's gonna have any other opinions, really. This seems like the most sound structure to me. But again, let me know. So now, let's continue with this pretty complicated puzzle here. So last time, I think I... I think I kind of understand everything that's going on here, but I don't have the solution. So, it does seem like this level is implying that you have to have all of these fans active at the same time to blow the bomb in one fell swoop all the way into this turret and blow it up. But I don't know why you have to do that. I don't know why you can't have breaks, so we have to test that. Like, what if this one isn't plugged in, but this one is? Will the bomb, like, try and make its way back, or it will do something weird? I don't know. I'm just curious what's gonna happen there. I guess maybe it's just the fact that, like, yeah, it'll blow it into here, and then the bomb will just kind of, like, be here, or, like, be going this way and then get blown back again, so you can't access this and plug it in, and that's why it's a problem? But then this one should be fine, because if it blows over here, you should be able to slot this one in without blowing up, so I don't know. But also, I want to find out what happens if the recording gets blown up by one of these guys. So if we just let this guy out when I'm recording, you just die like normal, okay? But then what if we record the recording standing here and like doing a little dance, just being here right in the way of this guy, of the bomb, and then we undo this, uh, yeah, that's fine, and we grab this and open this up. What happens? Nothing. He does not interact with it at all. Okay, that's good to know. So that probably is something to do with, uh, how you solve it. Oh. Where maybe, what, where I was going wrong last time, I think, was I was trying to, like, slot this this fan in so it would get blown across but then it like targeted me and blew me up and stuff so maybe we instead have to reverse it where I have to be the one standing on this button and then making my way up and doing all that stuff while he's the one that plugs this in because he can be where the bomb is going to be because he's fine he's me recorded in the past so I guess let's see if that works but I don't know, like, beyond that just concept, I don't know how we're actually gonna carry this all out, but we'll see. Let's play around. This box is also suspicious, like, where could we use the box other than just on this button? That's like the only thing we could do. Oh. Uh, excuse me, thank you. There must be more to it than just that, right? I don't know. Because, like, we can't, we can't, like, place the box somewhere. I mean, we could place it here. Why, would that do anything? I don't think that would do anything. 
I think we want to trap him again for now, just to to set things up, but I'm not entirely sure. Not sure that's the best move right now, but yeah, let's let's try and set things up a little bit again. Uh, right. Yeah, like if we could get a box up here or something, but I don't think that's happening. So let's replace this and take this one out. And then... Yeah, I guess we just like put this in here and then we'll have the clone go up and like plug this in here instead. So then we'll have these two covered, and then after I stand on this button for a while... Do I have to take this one? Or does he have to do that when I record? He has to take this first. While I'm standing on the button, he takes this one and plugs it in, like, there. Oh boy, yeah, I think, I think that might be what we do. So... At this point, I think everything is set up. We... Oh boy. Oh god. Yeah, th this level is, is pretty hard to like think about everything you need to do simultaneously. So, at this point, we record. We place this on here. I guess that doesn't... Hmm, does that matter? I think that matters, right? Like, that we do it... Or should I do it myself? Maybe I can just do it myself and then just run in. Maybe that's better. I don't know, man. That it's it's hard to like predict everything that will happen. But we record. Someone places this here. This guy goes in. The recording will take this fan, slot it in uh, up here. Then go over here, uh, taking this fan out, slotting it in here, which should then blow the bomb out this way. Yeah, so we, we don't want to, like, let the bomb out while I'm recording, because then it'll be here and I'll die during the recording. So then that'll be fine. That'll have the real one. This will have the, like, clone one. This will have the clone one. And then once I already know that he's gonna be blown away. I should be able to go up here in real time while the recording is still going on and take this one and plug it in here. Right? I think I might have all of that correct, but it's very hard to, to know for sure. Let's try it. So, we take this fan. Oh god, no, I'm... Yeah, I'm not thinking about this. We can't get this... this up here. So that doesn't work. And there's no way we can, like... We can't, like, take it from him or anything. Right? Hmm. If he grabs something, I can't just, like, take a copy of it. No. Man, you're blue. You're very blue. It's kind of hard to look at. No, that's that's not it. That doesn't do anything. Okay, so that's not going to work having this fan. So how how else do we get fans up here? Uh right, this doesn't need to be jammed right now either. But what oh god. Am I not short a fan? I guess maybe it doesn't matter. I guess, yeah, I, I really should test just what happens, like... If we just get the bomb up here... ...safely. That might be fine. So, let, let's just try, like, removing this... ...and... ...we'll just record... Uh, ...we'll just record him... ...just kinda standing around here. Like, it doesn't matter. Just until I'm, like, up here and the bomb will be in place here. Then he grabs this and slots it in here. That should have the bomb going all the way over here, right? And then we just, like, speed up even longer. 
just to see what actually happens here. So, we let him lose. And then I have to be careful here. Wait, what just happened? Where's the bomb? Holy crap! What? Why is the bomb... I didn't stand on the thing! What am I doing? Yeah, I just forgot to stand on the thing. I'm, I'm just dumb. Okay, hold on. Uh, gotta redo that. Wait, now we have to, like, redo more stuff. Okay. So, we record, standing around. Now I should go and hit that button. Then he slots this in. And then just, like, stands around. Okay, that should be fine. So, now we just run over here and stand here. Oh, no. God damn it. I have to let him out. I think I, I still have time. Kind of a shame this doesn't have, like, a level name. Where is it? Okay, it's up there. And then... Now it's up there. So what's happening now? It's just sitting there. Uh, I kind of want to, I want to like drop down, but I guess I can't. If I go in here now, I'm just, yeah, I would just get like get blown away by the bomb. Yeah, so it is doing this, which is a problem. Now it's just sitting here, and I can't access this, me or the clone. So we at least need it to go all the way over here in one swoop. Then we can plug this one in. So yeah, okay, I think I have this figured out just fine. Whoa, that was weird. He, like, ran away from me. Okay, one more time. Let's try this. So it seems like the jammer isn't needed at all. It's just kind of for this this initial setup, which is a little weird. But I don't know. Oh, whoops. Wrong way. Okay, so that there. These can just... Oh, no. Uh, first, jam that. Yeah, so then uh oh god, yeah, how do we how do we do this? He just puts this in here and then this in here and that should be fine cuz this door will still be held open by the real one. That should be okay, right? I think that'll work. So, okay, we record. Oh no, now I'm doing the thing. God damn it. I always forget. I always forget like one step every single time. Stop everything. Okay, all of this is fine. I have to unjam this first. Good God. Now we do it again. Stand around. Take this one over here. Take this one over here. Stand around. I just want to give myself plenty of time, just in case. That there. This... Ah, oh, now we have to wait, but that's fine. Another pass. There. Now we wait for him. He's there. Okay. We're good. And... What? Huh? Did, is that a bug? That seems like a bug. Because why would that not work? Maybe I just want to have that one be like... Here we go. Whoa! Whoa! What the hell? What is going on? These bombs are really strange. That seemed like it was supposed to work, but didn't. So maybe I just want to make sure this one is the one that has, like, the main one. The real one. 
like this one, instead of having that in here, we just make sure this one is real, so that once we're done, this one would disappear and not this one. I don't know, this is strange. So this again. So now we take this in here instead. And then we unjam. I guess I honestly can just like let him out instantly. It doesn't really matter if he's going back and forth. Yeah, I think we can just put that there, right? And then I don't have to wait as long. We can just, like, record and just immediately slot these in, right? And then slot this one in here. And now we just stand around for a bit. So this should save some time as well. Like that. So now I just run in here and just stand here. We wait for another pass. There we go. It just instantly worked. We didn't- what? You didn't even need this one? That's weird. I thought for sure you need to slot this one in as well. Like, at this point, I should have to come up here and slot this one in here to blow it into the, the turret. That seems very wonky. Huh. Yeah, what a- what a strange level this is, honestly. Something feels weird about all this. Like, it doesn't quite work the way you would expect it to, but, I mean, that's... this is fine. We're doing something, at least. So now, just to begin with, we can just see what's up here, but maybe this is probably not what you actually have to do, right? Yeah, so now we need to do, like, jammer bullshit? Okay. So now we need to somehow get both of the jammers up here. Which should be fine. Yeah, that shouldn't really be a problem, right? I don't see why that would be difficult, like, even even right now. I can just do it, right? Uh, no, I guess, okay, there, there's a couple steps here. I have to, like, open this up. And then take this one. And get the fan. Uh, I'm, I'm just gonna leave it. I guess I have to jam it. Oh no, I, I don't need that fan. I'm uh, thinking about this wrong. So right now, we just go and record. Just him standing here. That'll let me get up while holding the jammer. That's fine. And then we can just do a couple of recordings. There we go. And then while he's, like, doing stuff, we can just take this up here. Yeah, this part of it does not seem complicated. I was kind of scared when I saw there was another level. I was imagining we would have to use a lot of stuff down there, and, like, what you do down here would impact everything up here. But it doesn't seem like that's, that's true. So we just do this, and, like... Oh, stop. Just record. Taking this and... Oh. Yeah, I'm just holding it there. Whatever. That's fine. Then speed up. Just wait here a little bit. I guess if I want to be really safe, instead of just getting in and possibly getting stuck, I could do this and just unlock this from here. And then we could wait for him to be done. I mean, I guess it doesn't matter. We, we're not stuck in here. Yeah, this is fine. So there we go. Are we finally done? Oh, yep, we are done. That's unlocked. Which means... Oh no, we can't take things out. Out of here. 
but what's going on here? Hmm. Kind of seems weirdly like we should be able to do something somewhere here. Like there would be a, a walkie-talkie or something like that. Maybe not. Oh, hello. I was so close, I saw the clouds and the gate, but I couldn't reach it. Somehow I wasn't in the right place at the right time. I'm not ready. I'm not the right version. You mean like the eternal ending? Or maybe this, this stuff? The other gate? Is there a second gate? I don't know. This one checks out, but I'm going to keep checking them all. Because of course. And then, yeah, we have nothing else down here. No other QR codes hidden. Okay. Nothing up there. Looks kind of suspicious, maybe. We can't do anything here, can we? Like, jumping anywhere? No. Doesn't seem like it. But there's no terminal here. We just, like, go out and go higher up. Oh, boy. What have you done? What have I done? Have you ascended the tower? It was cool. Have you betrayed my faith in you? We've already, like, done the faith part. I want to see what else there was. I'm just curious. Isn't that good? Isn't that what you want? We should question the things we're being told? I don't know. Sorry. I'll keep going, though. Turn back. I command you. Yeah, I don't think your command does much, if you didn't realize. Oh, God. Oh, dear. I'm not sure I have time for whatever is up here. I gave you this land to be yours. Birds. A garden in a world of thorns and thistles. All this was granted to you on but one condition. I can probably jump here. Not ascend the tower. That was our first covenant. And you have broken it. Yeah, too bad. I feel very remorseful about it. Abandon this tower. It is not for you. Then who is it for? You were deceived into coming here by that snake who wishes only to destroy. Do not listen to his lies. Oh. I thought these were like VHS tapes first. No, it's it's not really the snake. Because I don't want the snake to be here either. I just want to be here alone. Do you not understand? There we go, on the, the edge. Is death, mine and yours. I did not warn you out of malice or deceit. I warned you because you are my child. He's getting desperate. I'm almost actually starting to feel a bit sorry. Maybe I should just go back. Maybe there would be a voice line for that. Reach the top. Well, I, I haven't. Do not be afraid. I chose long ago to remain in this place and serve as a guide. I will help you to attain our destiny. You can never reach the peak of this tower. There is no purpose to our existence. I will show you the futility of your task, and you will understand. Yeah, there are two, like, very different guides and voices of something. But yeah, sadly, I think that might be all we have time for today. We're seeing a lot of stuff, and I'm hoping there's, like, kind of a lot to it. Some stuff to actually do. Maybe it's just cinematic. A very quick thing. And yeah, we can maybe like jump out. That might be the final star or something. We can probably jump out onto a level here. I guess we can just very quickly check that. But I'm not gonna explore it too much. I'm just curious like surely we can jump here. Or we can jump off here. That could be kind of fun. Like this seemed super suspicious, right? Where is it? Was it this far down? Yeah, right here. How would I land here? Ah, crap. Well, down we go. Oh. Hello. 
Where am I? Is this the secret? No? Well, there could be stuff here. Oh boy. There's probably a lot of places I could do. Try and explore. Which... Wait, which level is this? Just five. Okay, we were just on the ceiling of five. I mean, I, I want to explore more there as well. There's probably a lot of places we can go. But, yeah, okay. Uh, what if I restart the checkpoint? Where am I? Just up here. Okay. That's, well, down here, really. But that's fine. Yeah, let's leave it off here. A lot of places we could potentially explore and jump to and something, some place might have the star here. But I guess next time we'll just advance onward and upward. This is kind of weird because, yeah, I was expecting the level 6 of the tower to actually be, like, the top level, and you had to complete everything, including level 5, to get access to level 6. But now it's like, we're already going to the top, so where would level 6 be? I don't know, maybe even higher up, or maybe it's, a, like, a secret inner level inside the tower? No clue. Thanks for watching, hope you enjoyed, I'll see you next time. Bye-bye!